Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is an Adobe Audition CC 2023. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to silence parts of your audio recording without changing the duration or the timing of your original audio file. I am in the waveform editor of Adobe Audition. I just recorded this fake or sample dialogue track between two characters. So my name is Tull. I will be playing character number one in Mike's fake dialogue track. And I am Sam. I will be playing character number two. So the first thing I did was record the entire dialogue between the two characters. I went to the file menu, saved as, and I'm gonna call this the master. So I'll keep both characters on the master. With the master open, I then went to edit and I clicked copy to new two times. So it created two copies of the original. And then I just opened up each copy file saved as, and I saved it as each character. I'm gonna open the character number one file by double clicking on it to open it in the waveform editor. So on character number one, I want to keep all of the parts where Tull or character number one is speaking and silence all the parts where character number two is speaking. So first I'll make a selection of character number two. I can tap the space bar to confirm that I have the right selection. Hi there, my name is Sam. I am character number two. Now if I was just to delete this, it is going to change the overall duration of the original recording, which is going to affect the timing when I bring it into Adobe Character Animator. So I don't wanna do that. I'll press Command Z to undo. So with the selection to silence this part of audio, all I have to do is come up to the top menu, click on effects and choose silence or I can just right click right in the selection, come down here to where it says silence. And once I click that, it is just going to silent that area, but it does not change the duration of the original audio. Now come to the second part where I know it's number two and do silence again, I'm just gonna right click and choose silence. And I'll repeat that for character number two. So I wanna keep all of character number two and I wanna silence all of character number one. So I make a selection of this first part. I'm gonna right click, choose silence. I'll click on the second part, right click, silence. I'll select the last part, which I know is character number one. This time I'll go to the effects menu and choose silence. So now only character one is speaking on the character one file and only character two is speaking on the character two file. And if I was to open up a multi-track session and drag them onto each track, you can see the audio for the dialogue lines up perfectly and the duration of each clip is identical to the original recording. And to speed things up so I don't have to right click every time I want to silence or go to the effects menu and choose silence, I'll create a keyboard shortcut. So I'll go to the edit menu, keyboard shortcuts. In the search field, I'm just gonna type out silence. There is silence. I'll click in the shortcut field. Let's try option X. So option X, click okay. If I go to that back to the effects menu, you see there's the keyboard shortcut. Now all I have to do, make a selection, press option or alt X, and that is how to silence audio in Adobe Audition CC 2023. My name is Mike Murphy, cheers.